not in my name, said hundreds of men from all walks of life who marched to the union buildings. The motto was standing up against abuse of women and children. Uh, the purpose of this march was to conscientize the men, wherever they are, that we should, we should not be in defensive mode of the hashtag, men are trash. Of course, if you're not trash, then what are you doing about it? There are a lot of cases that are happening in your neighborhood, but you stay out of it because it's not your business. That means you're part of the trash too, because you're protecting the perpetrator. So we are saying as men, we want to conscientize each other. We want to conscientize young men to have a society of men, men that are able to love and protect their women, not to kill and rape their women. The recent killings of women has created an uproar on social media. Karabo Mokwena, Doli Kwabe, Bungeka Pangela are just a few. Unfortunately, the stark reality is women and child abuse has never taken a break. Buge Ramuerani is one of the lucky few who got to tell her story. I was going home from Mabonya Mall so uh, after I got off the first taxi to go catch another one uh, a guy came behind me and told me to get into the car and don't do anything stupid at that point I didn't know whether they had a weapon or anything so I got in the car and uh, while he was driving um, I tried not to panic so me not panicking helped me get away out of the situation. What I basically did was um, I saw that the door was unlocked and I immediately saw that that was my only way out of the situation. So I opened the door and I jumped out of the moving car. When my dad died, he died because he killed his girlfriend. He shot her. So this is touching because of till today when I tell people this story, I used to make it out as if the woman was the one that was wrong. That the woman wanted money and she couldn't possibly want money from my dad because he has kids to support. But till today, when this is happening, it, oh, it opened my eyes. Hore, no, it's not the woman's fault. Hashtag not in my name. The message of the march is clear. It's time for men to stand up and protect women and children against abuse. So enough is enough. Today, South African men have shown that a combined voice can make so much impact, this being the first step in trying to curb such a social ill. For ANN7, Basitana Pura with Ntlantlajele Union Buildings, Pretoria. Pretoria.